What's up guys, Jake Sleesman, Blue Collar Outdoors, and today we have a change of pace on the channel. We got an unboxing, first impression, so stay tuned so you can see what's in the package and what my thoughts are on it. Stay tuned. As you can see, this was actually sent for me from Vincero Watches. Now, they contacted me on the Blue Collar Outdoors email and we've been going back and forth uh, they wanted to send me out a pair of sunglasses to have me test them honestly and let them know what could be improved etc what I liked what I don't like so it's pretty cool they did send me these I didn't pay for them so just keeping it honest with you guys but you guys know how it is it doesn't matter if it was if I pay for it or if it was sent you're gonna get your honest opinion and I think that's why they chose to send me these because um, they referenced that a couple times they know what, what they're gonna get if, if I like it they'll know it so it's pretty cool to hear him say that uh, but let's get this out see just how these look I don't know which ones they sent I, oh they okay so it says on here I mean you got breaks it all down so they did they sent the aviator and green gunmetal so I'm pretty stoked about that I told them those caught my eye first off you open it up you get this bad boy right here this box is pretty cool on it, it's got live your legacy on the back it also has that it's climate neutral certified honestly don't know what that means but there's that so that's just the cover then you open it up, you have this really nice case. I mean, this thing is pretty slick. Almost has a leather feel to it. Uh, then you got Vincero on there again. Oh, that's cool. Okay, so it's magnet closed. You pop them open, and then it'll pop up. And then on the inside again, you have Live Your Legacy. And then you have the shades. So you got your shades here. And then it's also inside, you know, your lens cloth. And I do like that this is a felt inside. It's pretty nice actually. I'm impressed. Okay, so let's get these little protective sleeves off. Whew, I tell you, those are those are slick right there. These are the green gunmetal aviators and they look pretty slick I mean they feel they feel rigid they feel strong that's a plus I mean they are made in China that kind of sucks but then you got Vincero on this side real small and then on the back here it says handcrafted which if they're made in China I don't know how they're handcrafted it kind of doesn't go up in the top right up here there's a small Vincero logo I mean you can barely see it it almost almost looks like it didn't get etched in but it's nice because it's real minimal it's not gonna get in the way but these these do I mean these feel stout they're they're pretty durable but you guys know we're gonna test these and let you know so there we go first thoughts sitting on let me get these backwards here First thoughts, sitting, actually wearing them. I mean, I like the nose pieces. They, they sit pretty good. And then they actually do, this is like perfect for me. It like wraps right around the back of my ear and actually holds them right right there pretty good. I'm not going to lie. These are actually, uh, I really like these. I mean, they, they feel stout. I like the color of them. The nose pieces are nice. It's got a really nice... Uh, almost like a gel piece there and then this is actually one of my favorite things this this actually wraps right around the back of your ear and it seats them I mean they're they're there they're not gonna fall off your face these are impressive these are really impressive now just just some things about them real quick they do come with a five-year warranty which is pretty impressive I mean that's a really long warranty uh, I'm curious to see what that all covers. All it says is five-year warranty. I do know that if you're not happy with your purchase 
in the first year or 365 days, you can return the product for a full refund as well. So they do stand behind their product and I can tell you right now, I think these, I don't think you'd have any problem. I mean, these, I mean, these are, they're really thin, but these are the gunmetal stainless steel for the actual frame. So the lenses themselves are CR39 polarized mineral crystal. They're 100% UVA, UVB protection. And then on the top of it, to operate them, you have your single barrel hinges. But that's pretty much everything on them. I mean, I'm going to roll some B-roll so we can really show off how these look. Because they, these do have quite the look to them. We'll get them out. And... Uh, I'm gonna wear them a bunch, see just what I like, what I don't like. As of right now, uh, they, like I said, they, they sit well, they feel nice, they're durable, at least they feel. We're gonna test all that. But these are, I don't know, outside of made in China, these are, these are really nice shades. I wish we could just bring it back home. Just bring the production back here. We got more than enough people willing and capable of making shades, I would think, in this country. Okay, so I gotta give a huge shout out to Vincero for sending me these pair. Uh, the price on these bad boys is 135. Now that is cheaper than your Ray-Bans. Your Ray-Bans could go from 160 to 210 dollars roughly for aviator style frames. Um, I've had Ray-Bans. <laughs> I would love to know where I lost them, but these feel a lot like them in the quality. Now, there is some differences between them, but I don't know. I really like this gunmetal green because the green's almost like a, it's almost like a really, it's almost blacked out. I mean, it, it's, it's really dark, which I actually think makes it look really well. And then I just got a thing for gunmetal. I mean, gunmetal stainless steel. These are just sharp, sharp pair of shades. And when you add how stout they feel and how they sit on your face. I mean, you can't really beat them there. These are these are impressive. So as of, as of yet, the 135 price tag, especially with the box, everything, uh, it's I think it's there, but this is just the first impression. You guys know we like to give these first impressions and uh, we oftentimes go back on them. The only way you can truly review a product is to use it a field, or in this case, wear them out in the sun, all the good stuff, test them, drop them, all just daily use. It's the only way we can give you an honest review on them, and that's what we're going to do. This is just the first impression of the Vincero Aviators. Now these are, like I said, 135 and as of right now, they're definitely worth it. These things are slick. These are awesome shades. I, I can't wait to test them out further. If you've worn any of these Vincero shades, drop a comment below. Let me know what you thought of them. Uh, I've seen some mixed things on their watches, and etc. But I, I ain't reviewing watches today. It's just about these. So if you guys have worn their sunglasses, drop a comment below. Let me know what you think. I'll also put the link to their website in the description below so you guys can go check them out see if you like them etc i'm not trying to push you towards them i get nothing from them i just if you guys like them go get them but i kind of want to see in the long run how these things play out because aviators those hinges is what i'm worried about those are the usually what goes is the hinges so the only way to know is to test them so i'm going to be wearing these a lot seeing uh how they hold up and all the good stuff but guys we're pushing for 10k subscribers we're almost to 9,000 right now uh, we're growing daily and we couldn't do it without you guys just keep on sharing the videos keep promoting bco nation so let's get to 10k let's get that ultimate giveaway going with the turkey package if you guys don't know what it is your odds are if you're watching this video you're probably new to the channel as this is not usually what we do we do do sunglasses but we're an outdoor channel, hunting, fishing, broadhead test, pattern test, all the good stuff. Just no BS, honest reviews. If you guys digging that kind of content, hit the subscribe button, 
hit the notification bell, turn it on to all. We upload Monday, Wednesday, Friday. Uh, next weekend, we may switch back as Goose opens. So now it'll be Duck, Goose, and Whitetail open. There's a lot, a lot of time right there. So we may switch back to our two video a week uploads. But when we do switch, as you guys know, we'll, we'll upload a video telling you what days we're going to upload. We like keeping you in the loop. So subscribe, stay a while, check out the content. Check out the other sunglasses reviews. And uh, as always, drop a comment below. Let us know what you thought of the video, what you thought of this product. And I'm eager to test them out and then come back to you all with my honest opinions after wearing these bad boys, beating on them a little bit, and just testing these old Vincero aviators. With that said, make sure to smash the thumbs up button for your boys. Share this video with all your buds, especially those that like sunglasses. And like I said, drop your comments below. Let me know what you thought of them, the look of them. And if you've worn them, let me know your experiences with them. Also, just what are your favorite sunglasses? Just drop those below as well so we can check those out. But guys, this is Jake Sleesman, Blue Collar Outdoors. I got to get to the gym, edit this video up, drop it sometime this week. So, got duck hunting again in the morning. Hopefully we can get into them. Opener weekend was amazing. Had a great time with the boys. This morning, hunted solo. Uh, had one shot, got one duck. So it was kind of slow. I think the ducks were a little shell-shocked from opening the weekend. But it's looking like it's supposed to drop. Temps drop and get windy. So it should be good in the morning. But you never know. But guys, this is Jake Sleesman, Blue Collar Outdoors. And we will catch you on the next one.